Let's see what Dreamer's cooking. Pixar just announced that they are making Toy Story 5 today. People are not really messing with that announcement though. You suck. They really don't like that Toy Story is getting another sequel after getting four previous movies. And Toy Story, to me, hasn't made a bad movie. And Pixar as a whole has only made maybe two bad movies in their whole 20 plus movie collection. You... That's yeah. disgusting. <laughs> that is nasty, bro. If you really don't want Pixar to be making sequels then you should really just look at the reality of the situation. Their top grossing movies in the box office are sequels themselves. Incredibles 2, Toy Story 4, Toy Story 3. You don't even Funny see Dory. much God. of the Dang. originals start to show in the top 10. I'm saying originals like past 2007. Coco went crazy. Inside Out and Coco. Inside Out's getting a sequel. Coco could get a sequel. I don't know what you would do for that. Yeah. But it could possibly get a sequel. They make money off people coming to see their movies. They don't make money off of just making a good movie. Okay. They make a great movie like Soul. I don't know if Soul was to release in theaters how well it would do. I just don't see it making a billion dollars. I just don't. But shit is dead. What type of shit is this? <laughs> people don't like to go see new things. They see rehash things all the time. And that's mostly because of a family thing. But that's a whole different story to tell another day. I'm here to just say, if you don't want them to make Toy Story 5 or make more sequels of your childhood just growing up, then you can just go see Elementals. Elementals yeah, what is like it's be a great movie, a return to form for Pixar in the theater. And if you go see that, they'll see that there's more of an audience for their original things. You don't have to get a sequel to your childhood growing up every five years. You can keep your childhood sacred as long as you keep on going to see new movies. If you stop going to see new movies and keep making Incredibles 2 and the Toy Story sequels, the highest grossing movies, then they'll keep making sequels and sequels. And it's not a problem. Then uh, we just reacting to some videos real quick before we start at Hogwarts. Fine. They're making enough money to, to justify making these sequels. Yeah, remember the scene? Problem that scene was so that funny. scene was so fine. Like they like they actually went crazy. I can't even lie. Like this whole scene so, justify so making awesome. these sequels. The problem is basically just you and the audience. Me personally, I, I want to take, take this level of disrespect. <laughs> keep on interacting with Toy Story stuff because you like Toy Story. You're going to go see Toy Story 5 whether it's good or it's not. That's the problem. If you don't like it, don't go see it. Don't talk mess about it and then go see it. Talk mess about it, then don't go see it. That's how it should work, but it doesn't in this day and age. There's a big fan base of Pixar fans, a big fan base, and they know that Pixar makes a lot of money on just the simple sequels. And the simple sequels sometimes are less good than their originals, but they're not bad. It's a Pixar movie. They're fans of Pixar because they know that Pixar don't miss that much. And when they do miss, they miss, I can't lie. <laughs> Most of the time, they got great movies. And at the end of the day, it's just a Toy Story movie. It's not gonna change our lives. Hello. <laughs> There's no like secret agenda with another Toy Story movie. Watch it if you want to. Go watch Elementals. <laughs> Elemental. If you don't want to watch it and you Ugh. want original things from Pixar, yeah, they miss freaking the day, by like hey, light free years. Speech, I guess. Yeah, well, freedom of speech. <laughs>